Hey everybody, thank you for coming to OB Enterprise. We're here today to demo a new locksmithing tool. This is a mortise cylinder die. It's for re-threading and restoring threads on a mortise cylinder lock. In the package what you'll have is a two-piece die and it also comes with a piece of rubber. Um, what we do is the rubber for is we slide it over the face of the cylinder if for any reason the, the threads are damaged so bad that you have to grab it with a pair of channel locks. So for demo purposes, we're going to go ahead and just hit this mortise cylinder a couple times around the edges, kind of, kind of rough them up some. So how ours works on the, the die is instead of starting at the end and trying to working our way back and working through the damaged parts of the thread, we're going to start in the back where the threads are good and work back out towards the portions that are damaged. So virtually what you're going to do is you're going to take the, the half the die and you can see it is sectioned out where it's offset the pins are. Some of them come with a stamp on each side of the tool. Just make sure the stamp sides line up with each other. You can see they're offset. So what we're going to do, take the mortise cylinder, move back down towards the front where it's actually where the threads are nice and neat and clean. Drop it and you'll feel it start to slide and rotate are nice and smooth. Take the other half of the die and make sure you got the pinholes lined up. If not, it'll, you'll definitely be able to tell. It won't line up on there correctly, so just drop it back on top. Once you do that, we're going to come over here or lock it into a vise. At this point, we can run the piece of rubber over the top of the mortise cylinder real quick. This will give you something to grab onto. And or if it's the threads are damaged that bad, you can actually grab a pair of chain locks and slowly work it around. So far, what I've found is most of the time you can just use it and rotate it out until you get the damaged portion of the threads and work your way through them. Work it back and forth a few times until you actually rotate the mortise cylinder all the way out of the tool. Threads have all cleaned up and have all been restored back to your uh, uh, weight to where they'll actually re-thread back in a lock set now.